the politics of blackmail in our country. The use of violence for leaders to force themselves into government. Your Excellency, the situation is now for everybody to know that the only route to government is only one, the ballot box. And that brings a end to that chapter. And we ask those people now to go back to the drawing board and prepare for the next general election in 2027. I want to say, Your Excellency, I want to encourage our officers in uniform, the gallant men and, men and women who have lived up to their oath of office to protect life and property from criminals. We want to urge our officers to stay put and not to be bothered by unnecessary criticism. And if those people do not want the, the police on the streets, all they need to do is keep off the streets. Had they not come to the streets, our policemen would not have left the police lines. So they are the ones who have invited them. And I want to say the police are available for open invitation any day. So if you don't want them to have an engagement with them, please don't invite them. But don't sit there and imagine that you can destroy property, kill people, and then the police can come and kiss you. It will not happen. That's There's no policeman who will come to your house. So we want to urge our officers, and I particularly want to thank the Regional Commissioner Central Kenya, the Police Com uh, Commander Central Kenya, and all the commanders, and all our security and intelligence committees within this region, the five counties.